<laughs> You're right. The password is Rufus. I've said it myself. Cletus, Rufus, finally, I face you. Wrong. It's me facing you. That's what you think. I was facing you at least three seconds earlier. Keep telling yourself that, buddy boy. Enough with the discourtesy. Where is gold? She's safe. Well, that's just perfect. Genius. No, you're the genius. We had a deal. You were supposed to bring gold to me, and then I'd have taken you to Elysium. No goal, no deal. So what now? What's the agreement between you and the Organon? Well, why shouldn't I just tell you? Deponia is going to be blown up. What? Oh, yes. I'd forgotten that I'm speaking to a Neanderthal. Deponia, boom. Boom? Yes, boom, the whole stinking pile of manure. And Elysium knows this? About the blast? Of course they do. We placed the order years ago. What do you think the Organons do all day? Delouse their mechanical beards? What will happen to the Deponians? Well, uh, scientifically speaking, they'll be converted to energy. Mm, theologically speaking, well, let's just say there won't be a star in the night sky for them. Whoa, that's serious. Well, to be honest, Deponia is believed to be uninhabited. After all, the surface was declared uninhabitable eons ago. Just when the controlled destruction was imminent, rumors started to appear. Supposedly, there were humans on Deponia, they said. That's why the elders appointed an inspector to get an assessment of the situation. And now guess who this inspector is? Uh... I am, you troglodyte! I see. Oh, one thing that I don't understand. Besides the meaning of the word troglodyte, why didn't the Organon report that there are people on Deponia? They know we live here. After all, they've been terrorizing us for years. They impose customs duties, they block trading routes, and they steal babies in the northern quadrant, which uh, might just be a rumor. Ulysses had his reasons to keep Elysians in the dark. But now you know the truth. Yes, I know everything. Okay, that means that Deponia won't be blown up, right? Hmm. No, wrong. Ulysses explained it to me, and we've come to an agreement. My report to the elders will state that the planet is indeed uninhabited. Deponia will be blown up after all. Mm, do you have any problems with that? I mean, what's it to you? <laughs> You'll be safe in Elysium when that happens, won't you? Well, you do want to get to Elysium, right? Yeah, sure, but... I don't care at all, but Goal won't like it. Well, you're not wrong with that assumption. Goal has proven herself to be a risk, but that's been taken care of. What's that? That is a consciousness cartridge. To be precise, it's a memory backup of Goal's personality. I knew that. Goal's whole character is stored on it, including all her memory. Up until she first laid eyes on Deponia and its inhabitants, she will never know what happened here. May I? Hands off! That's not a toy, but it's sparkling. Blow up Deponia? That seems a bit extreme. I mean, okay, it stinks. It's not really a looker. It's not really a place for someone like me. But I know a few people who are attached to this pile of junk, which might have something to do with the fact that huh, they live here and all. I mean, I'll admit, they are all idiots who wouldn't even recognize a hero if he happened to set fire to their cabbages. But blow it up? Yes, blow it up, demolish, cremate, eradicate, just like that. Whoa. I think I've missed something here. But you haven't missed that Deponia is about to be blown up, have you? Yeah, yeah, boom, and so on. And that I have to inspect Deponia on orders from Elysium to examine rumors about life on the surface. Yes, got that too. And will I tell them the truth? No. You'll keep your mouth shut about life on Deponia, so that Deponia will get blown up anyway. 
Oh, oh, bravo! You really did understand everything. Yes! Oh, boy, am I good! I'm so incredibly good! <laughs> oh. Well, I will never let that happen. Well, in that case, we don't have a deal. Too bad. You would have liked life in Elysium. Let me just quickly contact the Organon, so that they can... No, no, no! Oh, wait a minute! I wasn't finished yet! I'll never let that happen, is something that somebody somewhat attached to Deponia would say. I, on the other hand, uh... All right, great. There's no one who hates Deponia more than I do. Oh, yes. How much do you hate Deponia? It stinks. Well, your deodorant does that, too. My what? There's nothing but trash around here. Yes, company included. I deserve better. That I highly doubt. There are only idiots living here. And you're living proof of that. Okay, let's just say I hate this place. I don't know. It appears to suit you well. Say what? Do you know what it's like to wake up every morning surrounded by garbage? Between leftovers and dirty laundry? The wash basin is leaking, the toilet overflows, the fridge is empty, and the water smells like it hasn't had a bath for months? And then those permanent cries of, Rufus, do the dishes, find work, tidy up for once, get it into your thick skulls. The whole planet is a trash heap. We walk on trash. We eat junk. You want me to get my ass into gear? You can wash my ass, disappear. I'm going where potential is not just fertilizer that gets strewn on the cabbage beds. What can a man achieve in this trash heap anyway? Be freaking mayor of freaking garbage town? The job that even the noble master dodger of responsibility didn't want? Count me out. You hear me, dad? Count me out. And you know something else? I hope you fell into a manure tank. I'll wave goodbye when I pass you on my way to Elysium. Look at me. Who's the filthy little litter bug now? Huh? Who's the litter bug now? <sighs> okay. You really do seem to hate Deponia. You think? The Organon really plans to blow up Deponia? Hmm, exactly. The whole stinking pile of rubbish. Kablooey! <laughs> Do you have any problems with that? All right, great. Oh, yes. How much do you hate? Okay. Why do you bear such a striking resemblance to me? You've got that wrong. You bear a striking resemblance to me. You wish. You look more like me than I look like you. Only I am much less ugly. Oh, yeah? Well, you're even much, much uglier. Hey, yes. Have you looked in a mirror lately? Yeah, that's one of my favorite pastimes. Same here. Stop repeating everything I say. Only if you stop repeating everything I say. But you're the one who's repeating everything I say. No, it's you. No, it's you. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? <laughs> So, the deal is still on? Only if you keep your side of the bargain. And you, yours. Ladies first. Grrr. Why should I trust you? Why should I trust you? I asked first. Stop repeating everything I say. Only if you stop repeating everything I say. But you're the one who's repeating everything I say. No, it's you. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'll go and fetch gold, finally. Hands off! Damn! This guy's luggage. I bet he forgot the bolt cutter. Of course not. You never know when you have to cut through a wire fence. No. What a beauty. 
strong, sturdy, and apart from a few bruises, in an overall excellent condition. Oh yes, reflections in windows are great.